totally forgot my sweater at Ryan and Sinead's house last night. That's mine, it's mine. From rap god to twerker, incredible. And so I've just been freezing this whole way here. A few moments later. Okay, class is all done and I'm just going to Ryan's house because I forgot my sweater there and all of Megan's stuff is there too. How are you feeling today, Meg? How was your time at the club? No. Did, uh, what, what happened there, Ryan? Uh, the... She fell asleep. Had a wee nap. <laughs> <laughs> so she had a great night. Um, yeah. Person yesterday when we were ringing their doorbell. Did we? I don't know. He was like, who is it? Who is it? Oh, really? I didn't hear No. Yeah, right where I left, yeah. Hey, I'm back to school. One last class, three hours of basic accounting. Can't believe it. We need to do the entries using the information that. School is finally over. It seemed like today just lasted absolutely forever. Um, but we now have a week break. And I tried to ask some French kids about why, and apparently it's like a holiday for like priests or something. So, like high schools and stuff get two weeks because we're in university, we only get one. Anyway, I'm gonna try to take full advantage of it. I have zero travel plans right now, as of the Friday. Um, so I'm gonna go home, look at Skyscanner, and just get on the cheapest flight, I think. And then, who knows, I'll take a bus home or hitchhike home or get home somehow. I don't really know. I'm gonna plan it all tonight and hopefully leave tomorrow or Sunday. We'll see. Really keeping it last minute, as I always do. Okay, so for travel ideas, I am completely stuck. I have no idea what to do. <clears throat> This is like my last day to plan if I want super cheap flights. So, I'm currently in Lyon, which is there. I can fly Crete, Greece, and then Athens, and then somehow work my way back home. I have no idea how I would do that. Um, and the flight here to Crete is only 50 euros, and then to Greece is only 50 euros, and then I just bust the rest of the way up. Or, I can go down to Portugal, and then work my way up Spain, and then southern France, and then up. Or I could go to like Germany, and then down and around, like Germany, Austria, Switzerland, France, and I don't know what to do. Courtney has lots of travel plans in Italy already that we're going to do, and we're also going somewhere in Germany as well, and I'm just completely lost, and I don't know what to do. Also, like, there's so many cool, like, places to go in Croatia, but they're, like, provincial parks. So, they're nowhere near the city or the airport. So, you'd have to, like, take an Uber out there or try to find a bus, and it's just, like, super expensive. It's, like, another three-hour bus ride to a cool provincial park, and I'm like, I don't want to do that. Same time, I also want to see a provincial park. So, I don't know what to do. Maybe I'll just go to Switzerland and then go to a city and just start walking and climb a mountain. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Also, when the Europe squad is coming, we're going traveling around. We go into Italy too, and then into Germany, and we go to Paris. So those are also off my list because I don't want to be doing a bunch of things twice. So I just don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I don't, I'm like low key stressing about it because it's like tomorrow. So yeah. This is going to be the end of tonight's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, holler back at your boy. Hopefully, praying, fingers crossed, holding my thumbs like they do in Poland, that we have some sick travel vlogs coming up real soon. Peace out. I'd rather be